Okay, I just got out some out of the trash can, show you what it is. And this is just a small amount. You know, gummy, gooey stuff. Once I took that out, cleaned that out, and flushed the reservoir with uh, tap water, uh, way on water softener, and I used softened water. Uh, the wipers work great. Go figure, huh? Uh, wind up, I'm going to wind up returning that motor to AutoZone, but uh, show you how to access it. I still have it open from the front from the front wheel well. There's, of course, this piece right here goes on the inside of the front fender plastic here. And there's the reservoir right there. The pump sits back here on the front side of it. A little inconvenient. It just pulls out. You can just wiggle that out by hand. Same thing with the hoses and the electric connection back there. It's a pretty simple process. Uh, I've already got uh, put back in on laser whatever. I'm not going to go through all that through, through that again. But uh, if it's something you can't figure out on on your, on your own, well, maybe you ought to have a professional mechanic take care of it for you. However, that's uh, pretty simple um, to do, and. Uh, there wasn't a whole lot when I researched it, because I like taking care of myself, things myself, especially on this vehicle. It's been paid for for a while. So anyway, I um, hope it's been helpful. If there's any questions, uh, respond, uh, float them off to me, and uh, I'll answer what I can. But pretty simple fix. Uh, windshield washer pump for a 2004. Ford Explorer, six-cylinder, four-wheel drive.